Hey, hey, and welcome to my channel. Today, we are going to talk about the four reasons why it's difficult for you to lose weight with endometriosis. So if you have an endo and you've been trying for a long time to lose weight, it might be because one of those four things. So keep on watching. The reason number one, it might be difficult for you to lose weight, is the hormonal imbalances. And the metriosis means that you've got too high estrogen and, you know, the, all your hormones are imbalanced. And what that means in practice, it means that uh, hormonal imbalances can affect your metabolism and it make it harder for you to lose weight. And additional, the hormonal imbalances can cause the mood swings and the fatigue, which makes you very difficult to maintain the healthy and active lifestyle and stick to the healthy eating habits. Because let's face it, like when you, you are fatigued and <laughs> sometimes we, we with endometriosis, we have the chronic fatigue. That means we are waking up tired already. So it's absolutely impossible for us to maintain, you know, like gym routine or it's very, very difficult. Let's face it. So the reason number two, it might be inflammation. If you are chronically inflamed, everything is much more difficult, you know, and the metriosis is condition characterized by the chronic inflammation, which can lead to the weight gain and difficulty losing weight. And inflammation can also cause pain and discomfort, making it harder to engage in physical activity. This is something very, very big because uh, I was thinking that I'm fat and it's actually turned out I've been just inflamed. And when the inflammation goes, all the puffiness from your face, from your belly, that will go away too. So that might be a very, very difficult reason. And number three is the gut health. Endometriosis can affect your gut, leading to digestive issues such as bloating, constipation, diarrhea, we all know that. And these issues can affect the absorption of nutrients and impact weight loss efforts. So if you're not able to digest the good food, what the good food is, you know, means for you, if, if you can't digest it, do you know what I mean? And sometimes it, when you've got the gut problem, even good food can make you feel bloated because your gut is not able to digest them. It's just too heavy for your gut, like, for example, with a lot of fiber. So additionally, gut, gut health is linked to overall health and well-being. So addressing any gut issues can be beneficial for the weight loss. Yeah, everything starts in the gut. And the last one, medication. Yep, some medication used to manage endometriosis, such as contraception pills, can affect your weight. For example, some women may experience weight gain as a side effects of this uh, contraception pills. I remember when I was on the pill, I put so much weight, like even even my ears, I couldn't put the earring, earrings on because my, my ears were so bloated and so, you know, full. So that might be the four reasons. Let me know in the comment section which reason is preventing you, what you think. And now the things what you can do about it, because there's some things you can do about it. So number one, what you can do about it, heal your gut. Everything starts from the gut. So if you are uh, thinking that you might have a gut related problem, first focus on healing your gut. Number two, when your gut is okay, implement endometriosis diet, okay? Number three, this is the part of endo diet, ditch the refined sugar. When the refined sugar is off, your weight will be off as well. You will see. And number four, balance your hormones naturally. If you don't know how to do it, check um, my uh, YouTube channel because there is the playlist of four days workshop of how to heal your hormones naturally. So just watch every video implement it, and you will be fine. Okay. And remember, take care of your body because this is the only place you have to live. I hope this video was helpful. As always, click the like button, subscribe and share it with everyone so we can all come together and heal together. I love you so much and see you in the next video. Bye.